Hello friends, today we are going to learn about reversible pulpitis. So, what is reversible pulpitis? There are other names for this also like hyperemia or hyperactive pulpalgia. This is a type of inflammation which occurs in early stages and in this type of inflammation when the stimulus is removed or the etiology is removed then inflammation resolves itself. The stimulus which are like cold, defective restoration or caries when they are removed then the inflammation also goes. Coming to the etiology, etiology may be due to thermal injury, some trauma or any deep restoration as you can see in this diagram. The restoration is reaching very deep into the dentine and very much nearer to the pulp. Chemical stimulus like sweet or sour food also can cause reversible pulpitis. Histopathology Increase in pulpal pressure occurs which causes anema of tissue. White cell infiltration occurs and then reparative dentin formation is there. In reversible pulpitis, the pain is very sharp and is for a moment only and it subsides when stimulus is removed and it is more sensitive to cold. During diagnosis, in clinical examination, caries is seen, traumatic occlusion or old restoration can be seen, tenderness on percussion is not present and in radiograph, deep cavity is seen with normal periodontal ligament and normal lamina dura. For treatment, endodontic treatment is not required for reversible pulpitis. A sedative dressing can be applied and which is followed by permanent restoration and before doing permanent restoration, varnish or base is applied nicely. Thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon for more updates.